Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Starly Sea Glass over Essence Laguna Beach and I'm going to stamp on it. This one was requested by Shannon, Dawn, Diane, and Little Clay. There is the Essence and this one is Laguna Beach. I did already do the base coat. I'm still using that Starting Over by American Classics. I have to admit I am in love with these Essence polishes. The formulas are just really really good and I love the brush I love the bottle shape I love all of it this one is a one coater I'm assuming that a lot of them probably are being sure to cap my free edge it's just so stinking gorgeous and here is Starley's sea glass it is a very unusual topper. I don't go too crazy. I don't want just a ton of it on my nails, but I do want some on all the nails. I wanted to, you know, I got one that's being a booger. You behave. You get on there. But I wanted, I wanted some. I wanted it to shine. I didn't want to overdo it and put too much. So I, I was pretty careful with it. Look at that. Oh, that sea glass is gorgeous. I'm going to top it with the Fast and Hard from Vibrant Vinyls um, to get it to dry down and to seal those in. I only had a couple of spots of the sea glass that tried to stick up, and it wasn't bad at all. For the most part, they laid really nice and flat and didn't stick up and catch on anything. The top coat was able to, you know, take care of that. Look. Oh, I love it. Here's a swatch photo of that part of the manicure. Sea glass is yummy. I'll be using BM505, the bubbles, and the Nicole Diary, the baby light blue, NS07. My Bundle Monster Monocle Stamper slash Maniology and my Clear Jelly Scraper. So I decided I didn't want to cover up all of the nails with stamping. I know, you're shocked. <laughs> I'm going to do bubbles on my ring finger and my thumb. And then I'm going to do a, another image on my middle nail. But I'm going to leave my pinky and my pointer finger open. I'm using the BM504. I'm using that little jellyfish image, the single one. I don't know, it spoke to me, so I went ahead and used it. <laughs> Use a little piece of tape there to get up the excess, the unwanted. So there we go. And now for a little bit of cleanup. I'll be using a piece of tape as I normally do and this one is coming up really really well so so easy love it when it's easy and I forgot to do it immediately after <laughs> but it's still coming up quite well even though I forgot there we go so I'm gonna go in with the born pretty smudge free top coat and seal this in um, somebody has asked why I use this. I use this smudge free real quick to make sure it doesn't smear. But then I always use my favorite top coat or a favorite top coat to seal the design in and get it all glossy and everything. Which today is posh. I am back to my poshness. I do love the posh top coat. But I like to add it. It's a quick dry top coat. It um, It's a little thick it uh, it just makes my manicures last so there we go there is my mani I'd love to hear what you think about it leave me a comment thank you for watching until next time be good to yourself